I want to take a call and I want to discuss what mission I should play through. It's going to be brief and I'm going to go to him. He's, he's a lovely boy and he calls in a lot and uh, we're going to keep it quick and I'm going to talk to my dear sweetie, the last Cody. Hi. Now, those of you in the chat, if you can help me out, I've been having this problem with Skype and when I answer a Skype call, my microphone seems to get amplified and very loud. Uh, can I get a one in the chat if that happened or a two if everything worked out fine? Remember, I don't want to see 420. I don't want to see any, um, 69. Cody, you don't want to see 69. Is that correct? I don't want to see bits. I want to see seriousness. (laughs) Yeah, no bits, seriousness. The chats, I, we must be on quite a lag because I am not seeing a one or a two. Remember, oh, a two, everything is fine. I must have fixed it. That's what the troubleshooting, that's why we're, we're running about 12 minutes late. But I, I ensure to give you guys a little extra at the end of the show tonight. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> okay, Cody. Yes. Now, what I wanted to ask you was if you think I should play the main storyline or some side ops. I kind of was feeling uh... like I have the most fun in the deja vu, the unlockable side op. Uh, I think you should do side ops. Maybe a run around it, in there. Too, it's too early to do the main mission. It's too early, you know. Yeah. Although I've seen, I saw someone speed run it in five minutes. Why would I pay? It's just the demo. Why would I pay a full retail price for this game if it is beatable in five minutes? This game, you pop it in your PS4 and it's over before like you even like you know press the start button. Yeah. Okay. I it's it's all worth it. Yeah, the 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 five minute demo. So you're, so basically what you're saying is you're anti you're anti consumer, because yeah. you're playing this by playing this you're telling Konami go ahead shit on the consumers. I Feel am free. Look at look at my total play time. I think I'm like, what it, what? How do you read that? One twenty nine colon fifty four colon or point yeah, six five. Yeah, one hundred twenty nine seconds. <laughs> that's how long the game is wow is that is that really? 17 hours because I, I think I, I check on the app there's a companion app that's great but i'm about what i say 17 hours and i'm only uh, at 30 you, i'm only at 34 percent completion you know how you get to 100 percent how you let kojima t- pop a squat right over your head and just drop a load a, right a, on wow. your face, because that's what yeah. you did when you bought this. That's because uh-huh. I'm anti-consumer is what you're, you're saying. You're anti-consumer! Yeah. Fuck! Oh. <sighs> I apologize, guys, but I assure you, if you're a Metal Gear fan, you are getting your $30 worth if you bought it retail. $20 worth if you downloaded it. Uh, Yeah, I've talked in depth about how much I like this game, and I know Cody... Since, since I got you on the phone, you've helped me select the mission I'm going to select, so let's just get right in there. Oh, you know what, though? My previously interrupted mission. Uh, what was I doing currently? Let's just check in with where I was currently. Although, once I get into Camp Omega, I have so much fun just running around. My dear my dear boy Cody, you've played mm-hmm. all of the game so far? Yeah, I, I'm almost 100%. I almost? Have... Wow. Wow. Uh, I have all that's left. I'm pretty sure it's just like a uh, trophy. Like I had to get one trophy and then I'm done. I got everything. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I've got to get a couple trophies and I think a couple more tapes in the side ops. Um, there's a lot of cool online guides to help anyone kind of get into the little hunting for extras. And it, it's yeah. rewarding. Um, I would highly recommend it. The, the, the only thing I ever, I, I wanted to do everything like by myself, but the two times I looked for a guy is the, the Zoth badges, because I was like, fuck that. Yeah, I'm not I, gonna look well, here's the thing. The no, badges. no one's going to find the one that everyone, I don't want to spoil anything, but you're not going to find the patch. The last uh, one. By, uh, yeah, you're not going to, well, it's most likely going to be the last one you find, but you're not going to find it unless you do it by accident or someone tells you or yeah. you look it up on the internet. Yeah. Uh, and the other one is uh, part of the quiz for Deja Vu. The normal one, I was fine. I had that good. You know what? <laughs> I fucked up. Hard. <laughs> I fucked up on Hal Emmerich's laboratory. I was one floor too low. Oh. The first don't. time, but the second time I got it, I looked it up. Call yourself a film metal. Oh come mind. on! They <laughs> ask you what's the load bearing weight for an elevator in the game. Why the fuck you would sh- I remember that? Should have remember- remembered that. Oh, it's only been like 15 years. Oh, no. 15 years, you're right. 
Well, we're going to jump back into it like no time has passed at all. Thank you very much, Cody. Yeah. Did you um did you want to keep going? Do you have another question? I know I said I'd I'd be quick with you cuz I just wanted someone to my first caller to call in and tell me where I should um play. But uh now that I got you here, I want to keep you on because I know you have a lot to talk about with this game and in particular now here the 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 floor is yours, my friend. What do you think about it? Uh, I think uh, it's some of the best gameplay Metal Gear has ever had. Yeah. Because Metal Gear Solid, like, uh, when, I, when I play those games, I kind of, like, always had the mentality of the gameplay is cool or whatever, but it's the story that drives it all the way through. But this is the first Metal Gear game where it's like, man, I am super into the gameplay. Yeah. And I, I think, like, man... I, I have sunk so many hours just in goofing around and trying new things, oh. and I feel like I haven't done everything possible yet. And I have my save file is like 27 hours. Oh wow! And it's like, 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 just to think, like this short, like this. It's a short game, obviously. It's a short game. Well, the like, the the first mission, which is the prologue to the Metal Gear Five story is short yeah. it, it can be done in a half hour i've seen it done in five minutes um yeah and it's like pe people keep like arguing like yeah that it's going for two hours to demo it's whatever i mean like i get that i get it short if you're not like a real big metal gear fan if you're not the type of person that would buy vr missions or buy zone of the enders for yeah. the demo of metal gear solid 2 then i get that you probably wouldn't enjoy this but i mean like technically if you do every single mission once like all the side op, the main mission, the, all the side ops, once. If you just do it once and then you're done with it, like the entire game is probably about like eight hours. So I mean, like that's kind of a semi-normal game. Yeah. For thirty dollars, it's whatever. It's a discounted price even. Now, do you think I should go uh, old Snake graphics or Cyber Ninja sixty nine graphics or traditional? What not? You got it. Got to go for Frank Jaeger. Got to go as Jaeger. I mean, that's the cool. That's the cool costume in the game. It's the best costume. And you can run up on bros real quick. You can be real quick. I was. I didn't even know that was in Deja Vu until uh, until I found like I looked up something about hard mode. Which which I, which I think is great because I was kind of bummed. Chat that says. We chat says. Uh, Play as Cyber Ninja. Some Thorban out there, he's saying play as Old Snake, who's not in the game. Big Boss. Yeah. Old Big Boss. Uh, people are saying regular graphics, Old Snake. I don't know. What do you guys think? Boom. I'm, I'm saying Jaeger. Boom. You're saying Jaeger. I kind of like... Uh, I kind of like Solid Snake here. Old Snake. I got too many Old Snakes. Okay, well, let's go traditional. Let's keep the game looking how it should. Yeah, let's make it look next to I'm going to bump it up to hard, and uh, let's begin that mission. Well, so, what cassette tapes are you missing? I think I'm missing um, six and seven for Chico. Uh, I know where they you, are. Have I just have to go. Music tapes? What's that? Have you gotten all the music tapes? Yeah, I got the ones from Peace Walker, and I got... The Metal Gear. I got the ones in the Deja Vu mission, and then uh -huh. I got what was the other one? I got him. I know that. Got him. I got him. Confirmed. Got him. Got him. Did it. I wish my gain controls would stay where I put them when the next track advances. I don't get that. Why does it do that? <laughs> there, we're, we're having issues. <laughs> that reminds me. Have you did the uh, Ava Puzzle and Dragon shit? Yes, I have. For those of you guys that don't know, Puzzles and Dragons is an iPhone game, and uh, they have an Ava collaboration going on right now. I just got Oscar today. <laughs> Kinda. At least not a double. I've got oh, Oscar and down. I've got Oscar and I I got Ayanami first, but now oh, I, I don't have any magic stones, and I fear that the promotion's gonna end. Yeah, it ends on the 30th, and I've committed, I'm not spending fucking money. <laughs> no, no. I did, I did to get a couple to get that, that, that first, uh, Ava character. Uh, I, I, I just tried to grind some dungeons, and it's just like, oh man, this is, it's getting too hard to do that. Because the later ones are... Yeah. 
way too difficult. But they the get first... tough. Shout out to Puzzle and Dragon. If you guys haven't played, that's a fun Square Enix property. I think it's Gun Ho. Oh, I thought Square was involved with that. I think they did a collaboration, but I don't think it's Square. I'm pretty sure, at least. I think it's just some other company. Really? Okay. Uh, I might know. No, never mind. I don't know what I can say. Uh, I thought that was... I really did thought that was Square, because I talked to someone about it being Square, but... Uh, uh, okay. Um, yeah, you know, uh, it's it's not that expensive. It was like four or five bucks when I got it. Yeah, but for one try, five bucks. Or an yeah. It's, that's like, man, I could have got a fucking... Uh, I could have got two Oscars for ten bucks. That's, that'd be horrible. Be the, no, that'd be my worst experience. I'm saying uh, the Puzzle and Dragons game itself was uh, only five bucks. The game? It's free, wasn't it? Not when I got it. I had to pay for it. Oh, oh shit. shit. Okay, well. Well, that shit for free, so. Look at that guy. He's so pissed. And I ain't doing shit. He's just going to see me and shoot me. All right, well, Cody, uh, I am going to let you go. Okay. Thank you for calling, my dear sweetie. No problem. You and all the all other, the all the other callers have left, and the chat is is complaining more than ever. And I tell them, keep complaining. We'll see how much fucking longer his calls get. Okay. Bye, code. All right, guys, we did it. <laughs> Cody, we finally did it. You did it. I did that shit. I had a lot of difficulty playing, man. I uh, I haven't played since Sunday, and I felt uh, not like I had any rust, but you know, I just uh, feel boom, different. look at that. So this cutscene clearly couldn't have happened prior to um, Ground Zeroes, right? Uh, no, technically, it takes place. Uh, this mission takes place, I think, in January, at least two months before, and technically, it's considered canon. Oh, it, it is. I figured that all the other stuff took place after the original Ground Zeroes mission, and it was all just kind of like, rebuilt Mother Base, and you're all bloody, yeah. and you can go do other missions. For, for the most part, it's considered canon. I mean, like... Uh, because, like, when you go throughout the mission, the, the missions, like, if you play all the side offs in order, it has its own storyline of, like, you're finding out about this black site and the secrets oh, yeah. of this black site. Uh, and, uh, so, and I think, and it ties into Peace Walker or whatever, and, uh, like, uh, yeah, it's, it's canon, kinda. In That's cool. Way. Which I like, it. hey, it's more robust than the Peace Walker side offs, or just, like, kill this tank, or, uh, uh, or kill this many enemies, or... Extract these other enemies with bolts. Or cover. find Zadornov for the fourth time. For the seventh time. Fuck. Now that we know that bitch Paz kept letting him out. Hey, oh, I found it nice odd. Uh, Kaz Miller, he calls her a bitch like three <laughs> times in this game. Which she's, like a 20, a she's, a, she's a 29 year old woman who's a double crossing double agent. So I, I think it's completely justified to call that character a bitch. But yeah, they played us like a damn fiddle. He does it too many times in the same sentence. He yeah. calls her a bitch twice in one sentence, and that type of dialogue always bothers me. You can't use the same word twice if it's something that stands out like that in the same sentence. But no, Kaz just got played like a damn fiddle. He can't talk like a normal person. He played us like a damn fiddle! <laughs> but hey, that is how people talked in, what, the 1960s? Like, Kaz is yeah. from an old era, man. Yeah, I love it. Um... You want to listen to the rape tapes? Oh, yeah, let's stream that. <laughs> Cody, you're a funny boy. We did it. It's shock value. <laughs> Thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, for sticking with us. And uh, this we pulled in the long haul. We're long. getting... Uh, I want to keep playing Ground Zeroes. I'll keep playing some missions. Dude, maybe we'll do some more GTA like we were talking about with Katie. Um, but I'm definitely going to tell you once, this is a piece of advice, Cody, and I want you to live by this. Do you have any parting words before before we let you go? Because i got something to say to you. Oh, okay, well, my parting words is don't lose your way because tomorrow it's over. So don't lose What your may way. happen to your beautiful 
Fight Club leader Mako. What could come of this? It could only it could be for the best. It Find be. out Thursday night if you got that crunchy roll, get that kill a kill. But for now, Cody, mm-hmm. I want to leave you. Are you there, mm-hmm. Cody? Yeah, I'm here. I'm listening. I like when you do that mm-hmm, like you're in mid swallow. What was that? Oh, it's, no, it's just a noise. I like that noise. It's natural. It's only natural. And Cody, I want you to know this is a piece of advice, and I sure do love you, and we hope to see you soon. Mm-hmm. But listen up. Mm-hmm. It's not cool to be a fucking hipster either. You're a fashionable fucking jerk off. Read something. Read a fucking book, you moron. Yes. Do you see that? Good night, folks.